Alright y'all, so I haven't done a YouTube video in a long time, uh, mostly because I've been working a lot of hours. Uh, just work, I haven't been fishing, I haven't been hunting, uh, but I'm going to start posting more and I'm transitioning my channel to more of an overlanding, camping, family type channel. Uh, I started working on it, started building this Jeep and I just now started on it. And uh, first thing we did is we needed tires on it. So we had it for a couple years now and we had uh, some engine problems, but the, it was just a $15 sensor. And once it finally went out and through the actual code, then we knew how to fix it. So first of all, let me show you what I've done so far with this Jeep. Here we go, y'all. So I, I put these hook road bumpers on, hook road uh, front and back bumper. I already had this Smitty built 9.5 winch. If, uh, if I were to buy one, I would probably get a, a 10 or a 12. <clears throat> but uh, I already had that one, so I put it on there. It's a 9,500 pounds. The hook road's got these pod lights. And I have these. And I did these Sun Pie headlights after some YouTube research. And those are feel on light bars. So let me show you. Check. I don't know which one I got. Okay, so there's there's that the light bars they do the the LED stuff so all kinds of different things and I don't know how to do all the modes and all that but it's got flash and all kinds of different stuff so they do all, I mean it does like countless countless things there you go so there's the light bar feel on made by feel on and they got the bright lights too like so off and then I think it has a light on. but they do the bright lights too and you gotta hit the switch on inside there for that so and now the sun pie headlights turn them on there you go then they do all kinds of stuff also so you could do a whole bunch of different stuff with that too but there you go so that's the big things and that's just just to uh basically look pretty i guess not really uh what i'm trying to do with my off off-road um camping uh we put these on because she opened the door and dented dented it underneath here so we put the armor on to cover it and then uh the back the back bumper also with the lights that are wired into the reverse lights uh, we put 33s on it 33 inch tires uh, all terrains and one more little thing that i did to it was we upgraded these to leds they're a lot brighter uh, so far that's all i've done i'm setting it up for camping the next thing we're going to do is we're going to do a roof rack and a rooftop tent is what I want. Uh, roof rack, rooftop tent, and oh, uh, power bank, and a fridge. Uh, that's that's our the, the big purchases that are gonna have to wait until we save up a little money. But so far, we started building this thing, and I think it looks pretty good so far. So. Stay tuned, follow the journey with this thing, and we're going to go to Big Bend National Park. We're going to go run around, and we're going to see some things that I, I never got to see. And so we're going to do some camping out of this thing as a family once we get the rack and the roof. We are probably, right now, we'll probably just throw all our ground stuff, camping gear in there, and uh, take it, you know, and we'll, we'll ground camp for a little while until we get all the other stuff. But I'm kind of transitioning my channel from just fishing to around this Jeep. Because I want to build this Jeep out and camp in it and travel in it overland. And uh, there we go. Y'all stay tuned.